Parents have a duty to financially support their children and can consequently be ordered to pay child support. But what about step-parents? In Miller v. Miller, we explore the scope of a step-parent's duty of support. While married, Gladys Miller and Ralph Fabra had two daughters. After the couple divorced, Ralph supported the children until he went to prison two years later. Gladys subsequently married Jay Miller. During the marriage, Jay financially supported the children and developed a fatherly relationship with them. When Ralph was released from prison, he wanted to support his daughters, but Jay opposed, expressing concern about association with Ralph's illegal activities. And when Ralph sent a check, Jay ripped it up. Ralph eventually stopped trying. Gladys and Jay divorced when the girls were teenagers. Gladys sought child support from Jay, arguing that Jay's conduct led the children to become financially dependent on him and prevented an ongoing relationship with Ralph. Consequently, Jay should be equitably stopped or prevented from denying a duty of support. Jay countered that the divorce terminated any such duty. The trial court held in Gladys's favor. The appellate division affirmed, and the New Jersey Supreme Court granted certification.